Hi guys, welcome to Monitoring and Evaluation Made Simple. I'm your host, Coach Alexander. Today we're going to be using, we're going to be looking at how you can host monitoring and evaluation meetings using a online platform called Zoom. So Zoom, maybe let's go to that website. You, you type Zoom there. Zoom is an online conferencing platform that many people are using especially today that we have this COVID-19 pandemic. And a lot of people who normally work are having to work from home. But I can tell you one thing, even though there is this pandemic, activities still need to go on. Because if you don't do any work and there's nothing that is happening, I mean, you just become irrelevant and then your unit will have to shut down, especially if you're in the m and section. So I'm here on this website called uh, Zoom, and uh, this is where it is. It's an online conferencing platform. So what this means is that for as long as you have the app, whether installed on your computer or on your cell phone, you can link up with the uh, different uh, workmates through online and then you can hold me hold meetings and actually there are different plans here uh, you've got the free version which allows a hosting of up to 100 participants and then it's usually 40 minutes that's the limit of such a group meeting but if you want to up the game a little you can uh, there's this uh, other pro version which is going for 15 dollars a month it includes 100 participants. If you need more, you can uh, look at this other pricing, but meeting duration is much more. So this is a very good website. There are other uh, similar apps out there on the internet, but I chose Zoom because I think Zoom is very nice. It's very good and I would urge you to download it. So now quickly, let's look at how you, you use it. So now the first thing you have to do is sign up for free. The signing up is already, I mean, signing up is super easy. It's like how you do it with all these other websites, but I'm already signed up. So I'll just simply um, do that, okay? Then I log in with my email address. Let me put my email address there quickly, okay? Okay, then let me type my password. Okay, so it's logging in now. It's logging in. So there it is, Coach Alexander. Okay, so now when you go to this, your profile there are other things you can do here but when you go to your profile the key here is there are two things you can either join a meeting or you can host a meeting so if you want to host a meeting all you have to do is because in most cases when you're hosting you would want the video to be on okay so you, you simply click there you simply click there so what will happen it will lead you to this this part of the website where it will ask you to download. Okay, I've already done this myself, so I'm not going to I'm not going to download the software because the whole essence is that when you when it downloads, you install it on your computer and it's much more easier to hold meetings with other players. So simply just follow the instructions that are laid down to you. Okay, so maybe just quickly, I'll go to my Zoom app. Okay, so there is Zoom. I think it's loading. Okay, so you you can sign in actually from your computer again. Okay, at yahoo.com. Okay, let me put in my password. Okay. Oh, what happened there? Okay, let me try it again.
Okay, so now, as you can see, there's another screen there. Okay, so now you can. So what what this means when you when you reach here, you can either host a meeting. You can just click this link. You start a meeting, or you can join a meeting. And in this case, if someone else, uh, maybe a field staff, or you have offices around the world someone is hosting a meeting all you do is join it because you have the app installed either on your laptop or on your computer so quickly let me show you just a snapshot of what it means to actually uh, actually start a new meeting one moment okay okay let me click there Okay, so it's connecting. It's connecting, it's connecting. Sometimes internet can be a little, 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 little slow. Okay, there we have it, all right. Okay, so now if you look down there, yeah, so if you look down there, you can, yeah, so now, I don't know why it went. Okay, so if you look down there, there's join audio. So simply press that button and you'll be able to host the meeting. Then you can also stop the video if you want. So now at the moment, what is happening, if you look there, there is a one participant that is there. Okay, and uh, I, I know where this participant is coming from i was helping a friend start the zoom because they didn't know how to do the zoom themselves so i i did add them to this i did send them a link so even if i click there i'll be able to to to, to share information through via video calling with that person okay so i hope you've enjoyed this video this is really a short uh, a short tutorial and if you look at the screen if you look at the screen it's a little bit pink eh? yeah that is just there because um uh, i i don't want you to see my face <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a little picture picture sensitive i don't like being seen online so that's why usually i do the video so my thumb is actually on the video the webcam of this laptop so you can't see my face because my thumb is there so i'm blocking you from seeing my face but in most cases your face will pop up there will pop will pop up on that screen and then people will be able to see your face okay then if you want to end this meeting all you simply do is click there you end it okay you just click it and the meeting ends okay so i hope you enjoyed this video i've been your host coach alexander Please stay safe in, in view of this COVID-19 pandemic and see you on the other side.